Hey yo, what's up everybody, Holmes here and welcome back to some more Sekiro Shadows Die Twice walkthrough or walkthrough, not a playthrough and yeah, welcome back today we are going to be taking on Lady Butterfly and let's just <laughs> move this tatami mat to the side um, actually let's go inventory first so what we need for this is uh, we don't need the pallets um, snap seed, it's not a must if you have some, great, if you don't don't worry about it all right and I'll show you guys about what that's about uh, in a bit um, so yeah that's what we need and if you have if you have um shuriken just keep that uh, we don't need these two okay so let's just get rid of them and there we go shuriken's good for if um because I'm what I'm gonna do I'm gonna Stick her in this loop right here. I'm just gonna attack, walk forward, attack, walk forward. If she does manage to get out of it, and by jumping, we can just toss a shit again at her, drop her back down, and then we're gonna continue the loop. So it's a pretty simple boss fight. There's too, nothing too much that goes into it. So there we go. しいな。All right, the game will teach us <laughs> vitality and posture. All right, we don't need to know that. This is pretty much it. If you can corner her, it's the best. Sometimes, like her little fall can kick you back. But don't worry about it. It only does like chip damage. So that's the first phase. Charge attack. Oh, she's not gonna do her summoning illusion thing. If she does this long ass combo, she always ends it with that. Okay, you can just jump on her head. Okay, here we go. Oh shit. So, what you have, if you have a snap seat, you can just stand in the center, use it, and they'll all die. If you don't, Let's just say you don't, in case you don't, because I don't. I'm not sure if everyone has the snap seat or not. What you can do is you just run around like this, okay. And then once you see them turn into butterflies, you can use these pillars to block the attack, like that. Or well, some sometimes a few of them might slip through, but um, where she go? Get your ass back down here. If she sends out butterflies, we can pretty much just tank it, don't worry about it. Oh, just make sure she don't counter you. If she counters you, uh, watch out for follow-ups. Alright, since you're summoned again, I'm just show you guys the snap seat technique. You stand in the middle and you can just get rid of it like that. Nope, oh, come on. There we go. So 
don't worry too much about butterflies. If your health is low, then obviously, you know, don't tank it. Get some health up first before doing it. But other than that, goodbye. <laughs> So, yeah, there you guys have it, uh, Lady Butterfly. This is not too much. If she counters you, just get ready to deflect, okay? Um, but uh, other than that, just, you know, attack, walk forward, attack, walk forward. You have to watch your character's foot. As, uh, once you see Sekido take two steps, then swing. Take two steps, swing, okay? Don't just keep spamming R1, 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 or don't, like, take too long with the delay to attack her, so... Right after the attack, you just gotta keep walking forward. You see him move his legs twice, attack, attack. You know. Uh, same thing with uh, with her illusion technique. If you have snap seeds, okay, go in the center when she summons them, and you just snap seed, and all of them will die. If you don't have it, don't sweat it. You know, just run around the pillars, and then once you turn into butterflies, you can either keep running around to avoid it, or you can just use the pillars if you know if you don't want to risk getting hit. I'll uh, just use the pillars to uh, block the butterfly. So that's it. That's all. Uh, yeah, second, second boss down. And uh, yeah, we got her memory, and we got the Sakura droplet. Uh, droplet. This uh, can increase your resurrection power. So instead of like, we only have two right now. So instead of two, we can have three. So yeah, you can give it to Kuro, or you can give it to uh, an another NPC we can meet later on. Damn, the amount of EXP we just got, though. <laughs> uh, anyways. Okay. Uh, 
let's get our what should I get <laughs> upgraded firecracker or shuriken let's go with shuriken for now yep do I have yep I do miss raven this is kind of like a dodging it's like a substitution kind of thing I don't know I <laughs> didn't really experiment with this one much but let's fit that in See if Emma has anything to say. よく参られました。死体はまだ分かりませんが、あなたの体は世のことわりから外れているようです。返事あれば私のところへ来てください。分かった。誰にご指示のだ。オッケー。では。All right, and let's acquire some skills here. All right, we can finally get this one. <laughs> so we will, we can uh, get some healing every time we land a critical, which is gonna be really nice. Uh, mid air deflection is also gonna be really nice. So I'm gonna get suppressed presence and mid air deflection. And I'm gonna give this one next. Suppress the sound and then Shinobi eyes. But then we're gonna need to get this first. So these are gonna be my priorities. Um, mid air uh, combat arts, Shinobi eyes, and suppress sound. All right, these are, um, well, we're gonna need to get the run and slide. So I guess these four is what we're gonna be going for. All right, um, the Shinobi prosthetics, we'll worry about this a little bit later. Mm, but yeah. Oh, we have a memory, so <laughs> might as well do that. Oh yeah. All right, and in the next episode, we will be taking on. Where is it? Oh, we'll be taking on the Ashina Castle area. So there is a mini boss we have to fight, um, but it'll award us with a prayer bee so we can actually up our attributes that way. And uh, that's pretty much it. Well, actually, we're going to need to fight several <laughs> mini bosses. There's The next part is going to be pretty freaking long. I'm pro it's probably going to be in multiple parts. So, yeah. Anyways, that's going to wrap it up for this episode. Kind of a short episode, but uh, it'll make up for it in the next episode. So, yeah. That's it. That's all for now. Thank you all for watching, and uh, I'll catch you all next time. Uh, well, wait. I didn't do my outro correctly. <laughs> Thank you all so much for watching. Hopefully, this video has been entertaining or enjoyable. Hopefully, helpful. And if you all found at least one of those qualities in this video, then hey, stay tuned for more. But until next time, I'll catch y'all later. Homes out.